Good morning, Pat Zemer here with the MagnaWave Office Hours uh, for this Tuesday morning. What is this? The 22nd of January. I'm glad to be here. Seems like about, it's almost been uh, a month since our last Office Hours. We stopped at Christmas time uh, to get through the holidays and then of course we uh, uh, went, got ready to go on the road, and we're now on the road with the MagnaWave Express. We stopped up in the Ocala area and visited uh, uh, Peter D. Simone at his uh, facility there in Ocala. Then we had to run down. We were going to stay in Ocala a little longer, but we uh, got a request to come down to Naples and uh, visit with some uh, folks who uh, from New York who were down having some uh, uh, feet problems and back problems. And so we, we went down to uh, visit with them, uh, uh, some of Dr. Marty's, uh, some of Dr. Marty's folks. And so then we left uh, Naples and came over to the Wellington, Florida, Jupiter, Florida area uh, here. And uh, we're going to be uh, dealing with the folks in Wellington and doctors in the area. So if you're in those areas and you'd like to visit with us, uh, let us know and we'd be happy to uh, to come see you as we uh, have our trips going on with the MagnaWave Express. So we're glad to be here this morning. Uh, if you have questions, please uh, feel free to post them in the chat box and uh, we will answer your questions. If you would like to talk, all you need to do is uh, give me a call. Um, just text your name to 502-599-9972 and uh, I will call you back and we can have a conversation uh, live uh, to answer whatever questions you may have or further discuss whatever situations that you're dealing with. Also, uh, something I've, else I've got going on in this particular uh, today that we can share with you. If you'd like to uh, visit with us, uh, if you have a portal or if you want to call us on Messenger, uh, good morning, uh, Jeff, nice to, glad you're with us. Uh, if you'd like to join us on Portal, just uh, give us a shot on Messenger and we'll bring you up on the uh, on Portal and we'd be happy to, uh, to just talk with you face-to-face. Uh, -face. Hey, Aaron, thanks for being with us this morning. I know it's pretty cold up in Kentucky. Uh, it's not so cold here. It's, it's actually uh, pretty nice uh, for us down here in Florida at this point with the... Uh, MagnaWave Express uh, beginning excursions, and of course we're going to uh, we'll leave here and uh, some and uh, we'll go back to Flor back to Kentucky for about a week in early February, and then we'll come back down to the Florida area and we'll go up to North Carolina uh, for a period of time, and then we'll move back over to Kentucky and then hit the road uh, monthly from that point on, uh, traveling around the country visiting uh, practitioners. So again, if you have any questions, uh, just uh, post them in the chat box, and I'd be happy to answer them uh, for you at this point. Got a couple of new things going on. You may have noticed we have a, uh, a new device, uh, the Soul uh, device. Hi Maureen, thanks uh, for joining us this morning. We have a new uh, a lower power device, or uh, it's a high power device, but it's uh, more in line with the Semi, the Semi and the Soul. And of course the uh, Semi 5 now, a Semi uh, it's, uh, with five settings as opposed to three is, a, is another device that's uh, currently available. Uh, if you'd like to talk about any of those um, devices. So, here we are. If you want to visit with me, give me a shout. Uh, let's see if there's anything else that's been going on that uh, we can visit about. Uh, things have been busy. Uh, a lot of marketing uh, things going on. We have uh, some new developments coming that we'll be sharing with you here in a few weeks uh, with regard to uh, some hemp products. As you know, we've done some work with hemp products uh, in the past. And um, we are getting ready to uh, bring a full line um, to market um, with, with our brand and so on and so forth. So we'll be having more information about that um, coming up shortly. So uh, again, any questions, uh, just give me a shout and I'd be happy to uh, visit with them or discuss them. I'm trying to think here. Uh, it took me a while this morning since it was the first time uh, being on the, uh, doing this since we signed off before the holidays uh, to get everything, everything set up. Christopher Dillard, uh, our marketing uh, manager, has been uh, working with me this morning to make sure everything was, was set up. Again, as you know, you can, uh, you can join me uh, live if you'd like to come in on the uh, portal device and, um, and visit with us, or you can call in and we can have a uh, conversation right on the phone, or you can put your question right in the chat box. It'll come up and uh, we can address it from, from that point. Try to think whatever else there is uh, that we need to potentially be discussing uh, this morning. 
Um, let's see. Good morning, uh, Mary. Thanks for being with us. Uh, thanks for chiming in. Again, if any of you have any uh, questions, we'd be more than happy to uh, to visit with you. Got 16 folks with us at this point on the on the line. Of course, you know my challenge is if you share this with your friends, you get your friends uh, on with us and get it up to uh, 50 50 folks or whatever it is. We'll give away uh, give away an attachment or something today, and. Um, and at some point, uh, maybe we, we get up there, we'll uh, just to boost it up and we'll give away a machine at some point. Just to, uh, we like to have a nice audience and build things up and uh, have it working out uh, from that perspective. So, uh, again, I, I don't want to stand or wait and, you know, just if there's nothing really to uh, visit about, then we don't need to waste your time or our time. But if you do have questions, um, that you might like to have answered, please uh, feel free. Whoa, excuse me, I'm sorry for that. That was probably pretty loud. Let me take a look here and uh, see. Perhaps there have been some questions in the... Um, take a look and see if folks have had any questions here real quick. In the last couple of days. Let me come over here. Take a quick look. You know, it takes a little time to get back in the swing when you haven't done this uh, for a few days. It just kind of gets, uh, let's see, here we go. Well, here's the question. <laughs> question that came in on the chat line. Can this be used to treat ED? Uh, <laughs> told you I'd find a question. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, the answer uh, to that particular question is, is uh, can uh, the pulse electromagnetic field therapy delivered by the magnet wave be used to treat ED? The answer is yes. Now certainly the level of dysfunction that someone may be experiencing uh, certainly has a bearing on the success that could be uh, achieved and, and received using this type of device. But utilizing the paddle or even the, the butterfly loop over the area of, uh, that you're interested in, in uh, working with, uh, it certainly is going to do the basic things that the MagnaWave does. It's going to help blood circulation, it's going to help oxygenation to the area, and uh, people have had very good results utilizing this type of therapy. In fact, there is a device uh, that utilizes a PEMF type of signal that is used, um, uh, that is an FDA type approved device that is used in doctor's offices uh, for this very problem of, of ED. So it is coming along, this will work, and it is helpful uh, in that type of uh, situation. So great question. Let's see if there's uh, anything else here that maybe uh, I could come back to. Um, let's see. Okay, got a basketball, a, co a coach's uh, person writes, I coach baseball, basketball, and have show picks. Now that's a pretty wide area. Um, what, and I was wondering what machine you would recommend and how much is rental? Well, certainly uh, when you're dealing with, with, and we have another question here. Okay, uh, two questions. I can't take this call now. Um, okay, uh, the two questions that came up and then I have a third one coming back to this coach. A uh, person wants to power the semi off of a car. You want a pure sine wave inverter to use in your car, and uh, you can power your semi off of your car battery. Uh, will work just fine. I used to, year for a number of years, when I was uh, more actively doing treatments, and I had a golf cart, still have a golf cart, but I had a golf cart, just simply used a inverter that I plugged into the lighter, plugged the machine into that, and I was able to uh, use the batteries on the golf cart to power my max machine uh, as I was providing um, treatments. Um, the other question I didn't see, and I don't know how to make it come back up here. I had the question came up very quickly. Perhaps you can text that other question to me, Chris, and I can uh, get to that one. But yes, it can be uh, powered in a from a car type of perspective. 
Uh, the question from the uh, baseball basketball coach who has show pigs wondering about which machine would be beneficial. Certainly when you're dealing with athletes or you're dealing with somebody that has an injury that you want to, to get after immediately and have some results immediately, then you're going to want to look at a more powerful machine that would start in the area of the Pulse Pro or the Max Maya or Max machine to get as much punch or as much energy at the beginning of these types of treatments and so that's where the benefit comes through um, in that at that at that point the, the more powerful units simply give you more versatility to approach the issues uh, with more power to get a, a much more rapid result so in the athletic world we tend to go with the more powerful units now with that said if you are you're working with with kids or with people um, and, and you want to deal with them, and but you want to do it on a regular basis, then the smaller machines, the lower power machines, the, the uh, Vesta Dual, the Semi, uh, the new Soul machine will all work just fine. They'll help relieve the pain, they'll help reduce inflammation immediately, but they just don't have that, that final punch. So it really comes down to a, a, a time and a budgetary issue. So the coach who wants to, certainly on his show pigs, uh, with the various loops that are available, uh, the semi would work, the soul would work, uh, the Vesta Duo, any of those um, devices would work uh, to do that. So that's a good way to, to take a look at how that would, would be beneficial. So again, the more powerful unit would be the quicker result, but the lower power units will certainly suffice when it comes to oxygenation and inflammation reduction and pain relief, just gonna have to treat more often and for a longer period of time um, when you're dealing with those uh, types of situations. We did have a couple other uh, questions here. Um, Okay, um, okay, two questions that, that came across. Do you have any advice on treating pressure sores? Uh, the, the situation there is you're dealing with, with uh, bed sore types of situation and pressure on various things. Absolutely, the improved uh, circulation that can be achieved, the improved oxygenation will help the area be in a more healing uh, type of position to improve things uh, from that. Uh, Okay, question on the semi and the sole machines, and I will certainly get to that on treating. Uh, let me come back and finish up the uh, pressure sore type situation. The Again, to just treat the area, treat it, treat it consistently. I mean, you, you're not going to treat a pressure sore one time and have it relieved. So it's going to take be something that's going to require uh, a few treatments to approach the area and, and get, the, get the relief. Uh, talking about joints being ablated, would PEMF be contraindicated? Uh, in that situation, no, you just want to make sure that the, the treatments that are delivered are delivered comfortably. And uh, it goes back to the, uh, to the uh, treatment procedure that we quite often use is you treat as long as function continues to improve. And then you treat as often to maintain the plateau that you potentially have reached. In many indications, depending on how long they've been there or the seriousness of them, you may never get it to where it's totally resolved, but you may get it to a point that's very that's more comfortable, easier to live with, easier to deal with if it's a chronic uh, issue that just has to continue. But in some cases, you can get things to where they are not where they are no longer. A problem but a couple of great questions there let's see if there's some uh, any other questions let me come back over here um, I took care of those two uh, so then the question was uh, put uh, re with other than uh, spark chamber and uh, digital machines a comparison of the semi and the soul this and, and the, the primary difference is that the soul is a spark chamber device uh, in terms of strength, uh, the sole would be more in the classification of the semi-5. It is a little stronger. Uh, it is controlled just like the, the uh, Max machine or the Pulse Pro machine. Uh, so you can run it very low or you can turn it up to as high as it, as it goes. Uh, so thus far, 
Um, the people that have used the soul and trying the soul have been very happy with it. Uh, there are there is a difference. People, some people decide, gee, I like or I want the digital device for various reasons. It's a little more comfortable signal. Uh, it is part of our uh, family of products that are going to be CE approved in Europe. That we're working to have FDA approval in the United States and Health Canada is where the digital machines really fit the bill very well. Uh, other than that, the nice thing about the digital machines is they're lighter than the Max. Uh, the, the Semi and the uh, Semi 5 are very lightweight uh, devices. The Soul is also a lightweight device. It's a little heavier than the Semi. I think the Semi comes in at eight pounds and the Soul comes in right at 15 pounds, I believe, uh, 15, 16 pounds on the Soul. So it is a little, because it's a spark chamber machine, so it's got all the elements of a spark chamber machine in it, which makes it potentially a little heavier than the uh, digital devices uh, that are available. But that's the primary difference. They both are regulable, or can be regulated uh, perfectly, and uh, they're very similar uh, in power. Um, I forget what the uh, uh, Gauss rating is. I think we've got the Gauss rating on the semi to where it gets up, I mean, on, or the sole uh, with the paddle uh, being utilized up to 3,000 plus Gauss. Uh, it is also, it does kind of fit into the criteria that's uh, reflected on for FEI using the large wave wings and the large loop. It falls into the category of uh, uh, Gauss delivery that they're looking for for those devices. So we, our real goal was to get a spark chamber device that met the criteria of some of the regulations that were coming into place for use in competition. And uh, so I hope that answers your question. If you have a further uh, question about that, uh, put, please put it up there. Or uh, if you'd like to visit about that, give me a call or give, uh, text me your number. Let me put the number back up here again. If you want to uh, visit with me, uh, text your name to 502-599-9972. Uh, let's see here. Tell us about the HydroWave uses and a, an explainer on how to use the HydroWave. Uh, great question. I'd be happy to do that. The HydroWave is a uh, kind of just since it's been a while that we have discussed uh, the, the HydroWave is I'll kind of give you an overview of the product um, in, its, uh, in its entirety. The, the product was developed during World War II as a uh, chemical warfare uh, anecdote uh, at the time. And then it came, uh, some um, soldiers brought it back to the U.S. and were working with it and they were using it. Their, their goal was to use it to, to uh, clean pools and ponds and things like that. And at the time, the, the method of uh, manufacturing and so forth just was suitable for that. So then they began using it, uh, looking at it for its medicinal purposes. And basically what the HydroWave does and what it is, it's a, it's a proprietary manufacturing process to where they, they take the water and they treat it in, in such a fashion, they put some nano-sized particles of silver into the water. And I say nano-sized particles of silver, they're less than one part per million, which, may, which means they're not a heavy metal. They won't leach to the body. They will simply pass through the body. So they take these particles of silver, put them in n normal, in a, a distilled water type of environment, and then they run it through a process. And what happens is the oxygen that is in the water bonds or binds to the molecules of silver. So you all of a sudden have these little clusters of super oxygenated uh, clusters uh, moving in the water or available in the water. And when you consume this, the silver molecules become the carrier to move it into uh, the blood brain barrier to make it so it's available to the bloodstream. And so now you have these what we call nano uh, nano clusters of silver and oxygen moving through the stream and what happens when they come up upon negatively charged bacteria or problem bacteria and problem areas they come apart they attack the bacteria killing the bacteria coming back together and going on about their flow through the body until they're uh, discharged through the normal body functions 
which is why we continue to take HydroWave on a regular basis to keep this buildup of these oxygen clusters uh, in the body. But that's what it does on, on an internal basis. Many people over the years, and it's not colloidal silver. Colloidal silver is heavier. It is considered a heavy metal. It will potentially leach to the body, which can cause some, some side effects. You've, to, people have talked about cut, discoloration of the skin and so forth, things like that. But the colloidal silver was originally uh, put together and used externally on burns and wounds and that type of thing because it was almost like our first sterilizing uh, antibiotic. It wasn't an antibiotic, but it, would, it kind of fulfilled that, that position. Now with this, the way it was developed and used, it became something that could go internally, take the, the beauty of the silver uh, for its uh, sterilizing and cleaning uh, 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 effects and then putting the oxygen with it to, to make it a, a, uh, an attacker of, of bacteria, of bad bacteria and, and cells and so forth. And it really, uh, it really works. There's a lot of stuff out there. If you go to our website, you go to uh, supplements and you pull up HydroWave, there is a whole paper uh, written by Dr. Jane Goldberg. There's a lot of places where you can see uh, information on how it's used and, and so forth. Um, and now, and so the normal dosage with this is to take four ounces of hydro wave water, mix it with a gallon of distilled water and consume, uh, two, four ounce glasses a day is the typical dosage of the hydro wave. Now, many people, if they're in a, in an, chronic or an acute situation will double or triple that. They'll maybe do uh, an ounce or two ounces a day in a 16 uh, ounce bottle of, of water, if you will, and they'll consume that over a period of time to get more of the uh, super oxygenated um, hydro wave in the, uh, in the body. Uh, Maureen asked a question, um, I don't know what she's responding to her mind. I want to make sure I get to that. Uh, but at any rate, um, that's, that's how it works. So the normal dosage is four ounces in a gallon of distilled water. But many people, um, what I do is I'll mix it 50-50. Uh, in a, and then I'll do about an ounce or an ounce and a half a day. I just squeeze it up in the bottle and, um, and do it like that. And it, it works out um, very well from that perspective. Now, externally, when we use it, you can use it. It's very effective on pink eye and, and wounds, uh, that type of thing, to simply uh, put it in a little spray bottle or, or have it available and spray it on the wound, and it serves to clean, disinfect, and promote healing of the wound. Um, it's, it's very effective. I like, as I said, a lot of people with, with animals uh, use it on the pink eye, cows, uh, horses is very effective from that uh, type of situation or as a topical spray uh, on wounds. So that, that's kind of the basis on the, on the HydroWave. As a spray, you can use whatever uh, type of dosage uh, you're interested in. I know some people that have dealt with um, uh, pink eye and cattle and, and various animals have used it at, a, at almost 100% uh, concentration. Others, what I typically do is use it, as I've mentioned, as a 50-50 uh, to use it to spray on a scrape or a bite or something like that or uh, to um, use it appropriately on a wound. So that kind of explains uh, the situation on the Hydra Wave. Uh, if again, if you'd like to uh, visit with me about that, just give me a call. I'd, I'd be happy to uh, uh, just give me a text and I'd be happy to phone you back and uh, talk with you about the uh, whatever question uh, that you may have. If you want to give me a text, uh, we'll certainly uh, see that you get some MagnaWave gear uh, as a reward for uh, visiting with me today. And again, also, if you'd like to uh, portal in, uh, just um, if you have Messenger, just uh, uh, call in uh, through Messenger to, uh, to me and uh, I'll get you on the portal and we'll put you on the screen, put you on the TV the, this morning. So uh, there we go. If you have any questions, uh, please uh, uh, just let me know what they may be and we'd be happy to uh, discuss them with you this morning. Is HydroWave safe recommended to put in dog's water? Uh, HydroWave is safe. Uh, it, is a, it is a supplement. I mean, it's a, we don't make any claims. It is like supplements that you quite often you go buy at the, at the, uh, in the 
pharmacy, at the drugstore, the Walgreens, or the GNC type stores. Uh, we make no claims as to uh, um, uh, to what it will do, uh, but it, it is very effective from that from that situation. We put it in our dog's water all the time. Our dog's only four pounds, so we put very little. We put a, a, a quarter of a cap into the water uh, that the dog consumes. I mean, if, if I can take it and mix it and drink it on, on a daily basis, then it would, uh, and it works for me, then that situation would also be appropriate for a dog or a cat or, or a small animal. Uh, and it, it, when you read Dr. Goldberg's report, there's people that use it for a lot of different diseases <clears throat> that we deal with today. And uh, they have some, uh, they talk about having some very good uh, uh, results and how they feel and how they approach uh, what, they're, what they're doing and uh, what in fact uh, they are treating. Uh, uh, received a question, someone wanted to know about the MagnaWay certification process. Uh, the certification process is there. Uh, we put it in place as we strive and work to get uh, recognized and accredited uh, by various organizations, various states, state boards, medical uh, uh, regulation boards, and that type of thing. It is a level of education so we know uh, how to show you and teach you, the practitioners, what this device does, how it can be ap applied to various indications, and in various situations, what to expect, what not to expect, what you can talk about, what you shouldn't talk about, uh, exposing and making you aware of various studies that have been completed. For example, we have done, uh, we've worked on four different studies with our equipment. A lot of manufacturers out there today and a lot of different products uh, talk about studies that have been completed with their equipment, but they've never done the studies themselves with their equipment. We have, in fact, done that. We've done uh, four different studies, and I'll kind of go over the studies, but uh, we've done a study um, on, on lumbar pain, we've done a study on uh, prostate inflammation, a study now on, on uh, incontinence in women, and the, uh, the study on arthritis. Four different studies performed uh, in Cuba utilizing MagnaWave uh, equipment. Uh, for these for these studies. All of that information is available on the website. Again, coming back to the certification, we want people to understand whether they're treating small animals, uh, they're working with people, or they're working with, with large equine animals and cattle and so forth, uh, what is the best way to pursue the various uh, indications and various things that they would be treating uh, and working on with this uh, equipment. And so that's how we approach and what the certification is about. There is a test, there is continuing education required to stay in the system and to, uh, to gain the benefits of the system. As we work on with licensing boards and talk to various uh, uh, organizations that, that regulate how this can be used, having the education, and it gets pretty in depth. Uh, Aaron Hughes, our director of education, is continually working to expand and deepen the level of education that we provide uh, with this. So it's not it's not three or four videos in an hour. I'm not knocking anything, but it's not three or four videos in an hour uh, of discussing something and isn't it wonderful, but it, it goes on. It, it, I don't know how many hours of videos now. We might be up to 20 some hours of online education. We offer hands-on training as part, of the, as part of the certification. And as I said, there is testing required uh, to pass and have the certification and then we do require a biannual every two years continuing education to make sure that you're up and you've got all the various uh, information that is available to you. We found that, that people that can speak intelligently, people that can better explain what's going on and what they're working with is what is really beneficial uh, when it comes to utilizing uh, this type of equipment. Here is the link to the clinical trial. Okay, there's a link to the cl clinical trials. Aaron put it into the uh, chat box so you can take a look at, at the trials that we have done uh, with the MagnaWave equipment. To that end, there are three studies that are taking place in the United States now. One at the Henry Ford Hospital in uh, Detroit dealing with, with uh, venous wounds. That's open wounds uh, to the body. That's, that's wounds that occur uh, on the body that you would use it for. We're doing a... Uh, 
a test um, in a, a test, a, a series of studies in the, at the Palm Beach uh, VA facility in California dealing with bed sores uh, because it is very beneficial uh, dealing with bed sores and pressure wounds, uh, that type of situation. And there's a study that's uh, in, uh, in place at the University of Miami in Florida for osteoarthritis and arthritis uh, issues. You can go online and search for these studies to see that they're there and to see that they're going on uh, at these various universities. It's not something that we're just talking about. You can document that they're in place where they are in, in the process of the study. The uh, Henry Ford, um, uh, not Henry Ford, the, um, I believe it's the Palm Beach uh, Medical Facility, uh, they are working to um, uh, get the participants all in place for the study and bring all that together. So it, it can take some time to facilitate uh, this uh, time and activity uh, that takes place. Um, is the semi five more powerful than the semi three? Um, the the as we measure them, they're virtually today the same. The semi five and the semi three are about are the same power. Their power settings are different uh, in how the setting is controlled. The semi five has five different settings, and the semi and the semi three has only three, and high, medium, and low. And in some situations, people want a little bit more control over the settings that they have. And, and so there are five settings on the semi-5 and three on the semi. But when it comes to the power level uh, of the two machines today, they're virtually the same in terms of maximum power. Uh, the semi-5 probably goes a little lower if you have a situation because of the way it's controlled. With the low, medium, and high, we have to start somewhere. We, we can't go all the way down. So... That's kind of the difference between the two. It's really a uh, number of controls and how somebody uh, wants to deal with those controls and the attachments uh, that they're using. The Semi is a single attachment machine, single attachment meaning it, it's a single plug machine uh, that is a plug-in. The Semi 5 is using the, utilizing the new twist plug technology that is on the uh, Semi 5. The uh, uh, Vesta Dual has that and uh, some of the newer machines that, that we're producing uh, with our PMF systems uh, facility will be the single twist plug uh, type of attachment uh, connection. That's, that's another difference. Five settings, twist plug, attachment between the Semi-5 and the Semi-3. Great questions. Uh, if you have any other questions, just uh, put them in the chat box there and I'd be happy to uh, uh, take a look at them at this point and be certainly uh, happy to answer their questions. Again, if you'd like to portal in, if you got a portal, uh, give me a shout on portal and we'll uh, put you right on the uh, TV and discuss it from that uh, perspective. Let's see if we have another question. Um, certification, HydroWave. Okay, that took care of those. I'm make sure that somebody uh, hasn't called to want to uh, visit. Um, everything looks uh, calm there, so that's good. Um, let's take a look here just to make sure. So again, if you'd like to have a piece of MagnaWave gear, send me a text. Let me put it up here. Just uh, text your information to 502-599-9972, and I'll give you a call back, and we can have a conversation about whatever it is that you'd like to uh, talk about, and we'll get you some uh, MagnaWave gear to uh, wear and uh, sport, if you will. Uh, 502-599-9972. Uh, can we use C60 with the HydroWave? Another great question. Uh, uh, yes, the C60 can be used with the HydroWave. The C60 is a, um, a product that, that deals with the telomeres, which are the ends of our DNA strings, and it, it helps lengthen the telomeres. The telomeres are what they do a test on to check to see what your age is. I mean, uh, if you're my age, you're in your upper 60s and, and they do a test and it shows that you're actually, your physical age is in the low 60s or maybe a high 50s or certainly though that's where someone may be striving to be, uh, is what the C60 is, is used uh, to do. And, um, and so yes, it can, can be combined with many different things. Uh, to that end, uh, we have a new, it's not yet on the website, but a new, uh, C60 product that is uh, C60 delivered in gel caps 
that it is um, mixed with black seed oil. Now, if you'll search black seed oil on Google, you'll see that black seed oil is a very well-respected and well-known uh, oil uh, that can be taken in the body uh, for fighting various uh, diseases and indications that people have experienced is used all over the world. And so now we have the C60 available in black seed oil capsules. So you don't have to deal with the dropper and put the two or three droppers in your mouth. You simply take two or three of these gel caps daily and you're getting your C60. I can tell you I've been amazed at what C60 has done for me personally. Um, with, with with my health. Now, I always do, I do an annual, I, actually now I do a biannual physical and uh, for longest time, I was always uh, on the edge of diabetic. My, my cholesterol was crazy. My blood, it just, I just, everything was just not, uh, um, okay, I'll get to your question. Um, and, and it was just always an issue. I started taking C60. I went to my doctor and my blood work was better than it had been in 10 years. And, and that has maintained that level uh, for the last two years. I take C60 and HydroWave. Uh, I use my machine. I've had some prostate issues. And so I have to get annual uh, physicals in addition to my regular physical for prostate, my age, that's, that's a big deal. Uh, but uh, I just had my most recent exam and my doctor was very pleased at how my, what my condition was and no, no issues, nothing to deal with. And again, I attribute it to the fact that I'm using my device. I use C60, I take HydroWave uh, continually and uh, I've been very happy with that aspect of, of how I'm doing. My wife has experienced the same thing. Debbie uh, takes the C60 regularly and her blood work and her physicals have been very good and the doctors are very pleased to the point that the doctor looked at me and said, what are you doing? What, what's going on here that, that uh, and I explain it to them, and of course they look at you like, you know, okay. Uh, <laughs> so there's a lot of different uh, uh, aspects uh, to uh, approaching that, discussing that, and looking at that. So the question uh, just came through uh, wanting to know the difference. Someone has a max and someone has a semi, and they want to know what is the uh, difference in, uh, in how they're used and how to explain the difference. The way that I often explain the difference when I, and, and like I did, I talked earlier and perhaps maybe you weren't on with us on the line, but uh, the Max machine or the Pulse Pro or the, the Maya machines are our strongest machines and de deliver the highest amount of energy at the time. So in many cases, the result that's achieved uh, when you're using those higher power machines is faster. And that's the primary difference. The, when you're dealing with a semi machine and you want to provide a good overall body uh, body work massage, if you will, or body work uh, a mechanical stimulation to the body, the semi is as effective as the max. If you're dealing with an inflamed area on a joint and you're going to use the semi, the difference would be you're going to have to treat it longer. So instead of treating it for 10 minutes with the max or something with the Pulse Pro or the Maya, you might treat it for 20 minutes with the semi. So it becomes a, a time issue and people, a lot of folks have, have dealt with this and they've come in and they want to use the, a device for their clients and customers and so they'll, and they'll also have a budgetary concern and the, the semi is the way they go or the, now the semi five or even the, the Vesta Dual or, or machines that can, can fit into this type of a situation and it's simply a matter of time. If, again, if you're doing a, a, a body stimulation with the large loop or the wave wings or something like that with the semi, uh, the, the sole, the Vesta Dual, uh, they're, they're, they're every bit as effective as a Max machine. You just may be in a situation that your treatment times are longer. And, and if you're a professional, when I was on the road treating and using the Max, uh, the number of horses or the number of clients that I could deal with in a day was how I made my money. So I needed something that I knew in this situation I can finish these feet in five minutes as opposed to uh, 15 or 20 minutes or, or 10 minutes. And so it becomes an issue of time. But when it talks about delivery, we're delivering the same signal, the same type of signal, just not quite as strong. So it's a time variance issue. I hope that 
clears that up or makes it clearer for you. Uh, and you know, and just like anything, and we try to we try to work with our practitioners. So people that say, "Oh, don't use that because mine is so much stronger," that's not as good. We don't espouse that. All of our equipment is designed to deliver the same type of energy to the body. The variance again is time. And I know there are several people that have uh, uh, very well uh, produced a business utilizing the semi devices. And it's just a matter of, uh, and, and I'm, I'm a, I'll, I'll tell you this, if, if you believe in what you're doing and the people that you're working with can see that you believe in what you're doing and the results are there and they will be, then it doesn't make any difference what machine from our line you're using. Again, the time can make a difference, but it's your belief. If you don't believe or you don't project that your device is as effective as another device in the line, then you know there, there's, a, there's a credibility issue that you need to deal with in, to yourself. You have to really understand and believe what we're doing. And this goes back to another reason for these conferences or these uh, office hours that I have. I want to make this as clear as possible and answer your questions and explain this to you. You can use this information. Your customers uh, can, can see it and watch it. We have uh, the MagnaWave Education PMF International, MagnaWave International PMF Education research page on Facebook to where you can go and search for a particular uh, indication or a particular use of our devices and show that to your customers. So there are great areas of education that are available and certainly on the website, all the testimonials that are there uh, and the blog pages that, that explain this information. And just letting your customers, and as you, you ask the question, just letting your customers know if they'll do that, they'll see that, that these devices, they're all very effective. You know, it's like a truck. If you're going to pull a horse trailer with with uh, eight horses in it or whatever, you may want a dually. You may want a Ford F-350 or the Dodge, biggest Dodge Ram out there or whatever it may be. But if you're pulling one or two horses then and that's comfortable for you, then the F-150 does just fine. Well, it's the same thing. If you're not trying to treat 20 horses a day and you're taking care of your own horses and some for your customers, the the semi the the semi five the the soul the uh, uh, vesta dual are perfect and, and but if you need to pull that that great big trailer or do that stuff you might need a dually uh, or something that that's more versatile for what you're wanting to do and that's the primary difference they'll all get you to the same result just do it a little differently with uh, some different uh, time constraints. Uh, great question. I hope I was clear enough uh, in my answers. I'm feeling more comfortable. It was amazing how you, you take a month off from, from doing this on a weekly basis or in many cases a daily basis talking to folks. It, it kind of you, you get a little, cl a little cloudy. <laughs> Things can just kind of, you know, you just don't know uh, uh, where they are and you just need to uh, regain, your, regain your comfort and that's certainly uh, uh, what we have to do. So uh, again, if you'd like to visit with me, you can uh, you can send me a text and I will certainly be happy to call you back and have any uh, conversation with you that you might want to discuss. If you'd like to uh, give me a, a portal call, we'll put you right on the screen here with us and uh, maybe Elaine, if, if she's available, would like to uh, portal in. I don't know. It's bad weather and icy and a lot of stuff going on. Kid school was delayed, so she's got to deal with her uh, children, get them off to school, so she may not be available to uh, chime in and visit with us this morning, but we certainly want to uh, answer uh, whatever questions uh, that you may have. Just put them in the chat box and I'd be happy to approach them. And, uh, or again, as I say, you can text me and I will call you. Uh, text me and I'll uh, portal in or uh, call me, uh, text me, and we will uh, be more than happy to uh, uh, give you some uh, MagnaWave gear. Let's see, got another message. Can you help explain um, the marketing package and the hyper local leads? Sure. Um, great question. Uh, a lot of people come to us, and, and it's interesting. And I'll, I'll be just I'll just be very candid and, and uh, uh, upfront. In in the beginning, uh, it, it, people would get machines, and they go out and they treat their horses, or they go out and treat their clients, and they build their business, and they do things. Uh, then they'd want to expand their business, and over time, uh, it became very important that people wanted marketing help. 
uh, everybody is not a, a salesman out the door. And believe me, I, I don't care what it is you're doing. If you're if you're a, a person and you believe in this in this device and you want to do therapy and, and work with animals or people or or whatever it may be, you have to have authority. You have to be believed, as I was saying. If people can see it in you and believe it in you and you believe it, then that allows them to better utilize, good morning, better utilize um, uh, what you're doing. And so, but everybody doesn't have that same knack. And so they need help. They want things that they can, brochures. And they and in today's world, uh, with the internet and Facebook, we have so much power that you can tell people about what you're doing and you can show them pictures of yourself and you can do all this kind of stuff to help you have the credibility or authority that you need to, to develop your business. And, and that's what we bring to the table with our marketing package. We, we help you with your website, with your Facebook. We have videos that are prepared for you to use in your neighborhood and in your area of business to educate people on what you're doing, educate your clients on what this does and then we also do things that that we are marketing when people come to our website and they want to find you uh, they get they get connected with you they don't get connected with me necessarily they get connected with the practitioner that's close to them so we we have programs in place to generate leads as we call them hyper leads for our practitioners wherever they may be and we're working diligently we have a whole crew uh, of marketing people uh, upwards of 10 marketing people who spend their days developing these programs and researching uh, the internet and google for what are the best ways to help you market your business and and we bring those people to the table for you uh, we have a a feature that we call the control room to where if you're part of our marketing program, we actually monitor, help monitor your Facebook. So if someone comes on there and asks a question and we can answer it for you, as you, we help those people get the answers that they're looking for. We help them get the information that they want so you can be about the business of treating and doing what you want to do. And we've got this control room. Uh, we've got Bobby and Emily in the control room every day communicating and working to help answer the questions when they ask them. If you go look at the MagnaWave page, when someone asks a question, those questions are answered within 15 minutes or quicker. And, and certainly through our chat function uh, to, to chat with you whenever you want to do that. All that goes a long way to help you build your business. And so through our control room, we're working with your uh, Facebook, your Instagram, these places to, to give posts for you through our marketing program to, to help all of this. And so that's what the marketing program is. We, we realized that, that people were coming to us they, they like our system. We like to present a system that they like that works. Uh, and that's, that's been my goal from the beginning. I want to help as many people as I can, as we can now, to be successful. And for a number of years, it was me. And then it was me and Elaine. And then it was me and Elaine and Debbie. Then it was me and Elaine, Debbie and Aaron. Then it was me and Elaine, Debbie and Aaron and, and Jessica. Then it just, it just kept going. And now uh, there are in our office 15 different support people doing various things to support your development and your business. That doesn't include our 12 people in the marketing area uh, that are working with us uh, daily uh, in a, in a full-time type of capacity to develop information and stuff that you need and is beneficial to help you build your business. So I think, I think, hope that help is helpful. Uh, and if you want to uh, know about that, uh, give us a call at the office. It's 502-742-7868. It's 502-742-7868. Ask to, to talk to uh, Bobby. She'll explain uh, this marketing program to you and take you through the processes, demo it for you so you can see what it'll do and how it'll work, and, um, and then go from there. We're not, we don't pressure anything. We don't want to do anything that, that somebody doesn't want to do. We have a lot of people that are very successful doing their own stuff. If you got the time to do that and it works out for you, bless you. That's wonderful. Uh, if you'd like some support and uh, you want some support for a month or two, you can do that. Uh, just totally dependent on how you want to approach uh, utilizing 
uh, the tools that we make available to you to help you build uh, your business. And, and it, it's, it's very important. There are classes out there. People are offering classes to show you how to do this. And that's great. Uh, and, and it's great. But what I learned is I got to a point that I couldn't do everything and I didn't have the background to basically understand everything. I like to be kind of computer savvy, um, um, and, and deal with that type depth of uh, deal with that here in one second in those types of situations. But what I've learned that if I have somebody that's on the cutting edge and they can help bring that, uh, help me get into that cutting edge area, again, things changing so fast on the internet. Instagram, I I, I don't do Instagram. Elaine does Instagram. Emily and, and, and uh, Christopher do Instagram and do that kind of stuff. I, I understand it. I grasp it. But for me to master that today with everything going on, it, it's just not going to happen. So we have people that can do that and help bring it to the, to the forefront for you. Uh, received a question about the depth of penetration. Is it the same on all the machines? The answer is the depth of penetration is the same. The difference is the amount of energy that you're bringing into that depth of penetration. A magnetic field will penetrate right through the wall. And, and, but if, if it's a weak magnetic field, then it penetrates through the wall in a weaker fashion. You don't get the strength or you don't get the energy that you're looking for. So when you deal with what we're talking about with, with, with energy levels of 3,000, 5,000, 9,000, 10,000 gauss or greater, uh, depending on the attachment that's being used we're, used, we're simply talking about the energy that it's going. It's much like a spotlight and a light bulb. You can take these great spotlights. You've seen them, these big spotlights that the police use or they have on boats and so forth that are just, I mean, hunters use them. They're just bright. Light. Well, there's more energy in that light. You take a light bulb and you hold it up. It'll light up the area, but it's it's not doing it. You've got to have more light bulbs to do it. Or you got to let your eyes adjust to the, to the light that's being given off. That's what goes on. So the penetration availability is there at all levels of PMF. The difference is the energy that follows that uh, penetration into the body and how quickly that inner energy is utilized by the body to produce uh, and, and to attain the results that, that people may be looking for in that, in that process. Um, and I hope that answers that question. If you'd like, like to have more information on that, simply put it in the uh, chat box here and I'd be happy to answer it. If you'd like to uh, send me a text and have a conversation about this, uh, that would be great. I'd be happy to do that. If you'd like to portal in, and uh, let's see if we can get something up on the uh, portal screen here. Too. There we go. Oh, I don't, I don't think I called anybody, but uh, at any rate, so we could uh, call and uh, see what's, what's going on. Let's see here if I can uh, just give you an eye. Whoop, didn't mean to knock that. Did I knock things off? Nope, we're okay. Let's see here. Um, let's see if old Chris is available here just to show you how, how this, might, this might work. So we're... Uh, well, I, I, I just I wanted to bring you on the TV. Let's see here. This is Christopher Dillard. Christopher Dillard is our director of marketing, and uh, uh, we work closely together. And he works with Elaine and Cameron and, and Aaron and the various people uh, producing excellent posts and, and education through our practitioners. And Chris, I just wanted everybody to see how the uh, portal uh, operates here with us on this broadcast and to talk to him. So you might uh, give us a little information about yourself, Chris. Uh, so um, I'm, I'm the marketing uh, director here at Magna Wave, and uh, we, I work with a team like uh, Pat was mentioning earlier, uh, Emily and Bobby, to uh, make sure all the, the stuff's answered quickly, and we put out great content like these live videos from Pat, and uh, uh, we're really excited about you know 2019, the new products. Pat's mentioned the Soul, the um, the Semi Five, and some other things. So uh, this is what I like to do here to to keep the quality high and make sure we have a, a lot of education for people who don't know what PMF and Magna Wave is. Um, but I mean, I, we're, we're using the portals now. I love the portals, Pat. Uh, these, these have been great in the office to, to call people uh, and, and talk to them and, you know, uh, get, get ideas across the office really quickly. Great. Okay. Well, Chris, thank you very much. And uh, we'll visit again. I just wanted to show the, how the portal worked. And thanks for the information. Uh, thank you. Uh-huh. Bye-bye. 
So there you go. And uh, the, it's interesting uh, just to kind of bring you up what he talked about the portals. Uh, as I'm on the road traveling here, I, I do need to talk with the various folks uh, in the office. And if, certainly we can do it on the phone and it works great. But, it, it, you know, when I'm on the phone with somebody and I've got things going on, I try to multitask or, or do various various things so I get, I get sidetracked. What I've learned is uh, I can use the portal and I can talk directly to uh, the accounting office or I can talk directly to Joanne or Cameron and I can visit or Chris and I can visit, Elaine and I can visit face-to-face just like we're doing now. And uh, because that's where things are going. And uh, people want to see the videos about you and your practice and pictures of you doing what you're doing. And people want to talk with you. And so uh, in this, you know, beam me up, Scotty. <laughs> in this day and age, the, uh, as personal as you can make something, uh, the better off you are as you're presenting yourself. Again, to have the authority and the credibility that you're looking for to be successful. So we're about out of time. It's uh, almost time for our next meeting, which I will attend uh, utilizing my portal uh, here in, in the process. And I certainly uh, thank you for being with us this morning. It, it's, it's, been, it's been fun. Uh, it's been fun to get back in the saddle, if you will, or get back uh, in the process of visiting with you and talking with you and, and answering your questions. And we look forward to that. And certainly, you know, if you have any question that you want to have answered, simply call the office. Lee will take your call and direct you exactly where you need to go, whether it's marketing, uh, sales, uh, Chris with, with marketing information, or myself to answer questions that you may have about what, what's going on. We're certainly here. If you want to send us an email, uh, you can send me an email, pat at nwpemf.com, and I'd be more than happy to respond to your question or bring it up here on an, on an office hours uh, presentation so you can uh, get the questions answered, and then we can present that information for you. So, uh, have a great day. Uh, look forward to being back with you again next Tuesday on the next office hours. Uh, keep an eye out for some webinars that we'll be doing. Got a lot of things happening as I was uh, talking earlier about some the new products, the new C60 with black seed oil. Uh, we are working with the uh, complete line of hemp products with some oils. Uh, so that'll be uh, interesting and, and fun stuff to talk about. So stay tuned and, and uh, we'll have a good time. Uh, growing our health and wellness together and uh, helping you be more successful and, and happy in your world of health and wellness. Wave on to health and wellness and have a great week. Thanks for joining me. Bye-bye.